What's up guys, it's time to talk about Google. Google is all set to announce Pixel 4 family today, which broke all the record of Pixel 3 in terms of leaks. The phone that has been unboxed, reviewed, used for months, and even official videos that Google made was also leaked. In case you are not following what's happening regarding the Pixel 4, then you should watch this video till end, because yes, Google has done something amazing with this year's Pixel. So here's everything you need to know about Pixel 4. So first, taking a look at design, yes it has a square camera setup and instead of the dual tone design with that frosted gloss, Google went with a normal gloss like every other Android phone. Towards the front it has a full forehead up top with minimal bottom chin and side bezels. So this year no big ass bad tub ugly notch, just forehead which definitely looks a lot better than this. Moving to the display, so Pixel 4 having a 5.7 inch 1080p display while the Pixel 4 XL features a 6.3 inch Quad HD Plus display and both phones actually having a 90Hz smooth refresh rate which only OnePlus has done this year. And combined with Android 10 and new gesture navigation, this would be really cool but battery would be a big concern. Pixel 4 has 2800mAh battery and 4 XL has a 3700mAh battery and these batteries are actually very small. Considering both have 90Hz display, which will consume more power than traditional 60Hz display, but it will be interesting to see how Google will optimize everything so the display will not consume that much power. And for the first time, Google has dropped the fingerprint scanner for 3D face unlock, so you just have face unlock for unlocking your phone, app signing, and payments. I think Google should keep the fingerprint scanner there, at least the optical one, because obviously, fingerprint is more secure than face and no one can deny this truth. And along with Face ID, there is also a solely radar chip on top bezel which will enable motion sense feature through which you will be able to skip songs, silence alarms, decline or answer phone calls by just waving your hand. There will be a Pokemon game at launch that's gonna work with solely very seamlessly. Now as for the cameras, so once again the camera is the most high feature in Pixel. We have a lot of sample made from Pixel 4 and they all just look amazing. The portrait mode, selfies, clarity of images, details, everything just stunning. There will also be a Nightside 2.0 which will take really amazing shots in low light thanks to Google's image processing. There will also be a feature of astrophotography. Through this you will be able to capture stars with handheld mode and it works very amazingly. Now there is a new feature with the camera it's called double exposure your feature. It would definitely be a game changer thing. Based on the demonstration of what Google's official video shows, you can be able to adjust the background and the subject and through this you'll never get underexposed or an overexposed image which in real world would going to be a really cool feature. Under the hood we have a Snapdragon 855 with pixel neural core along with 6 gigs of RAM finally. And there will also be a new Google Assistant and Google has done some massive improvements in the new Google Assistant. It can now seamlessly answer back to back, it will now be very efficient and fast. You will be able to ask a specific commands and it will perform. There will also be a race to wake feature where when you raise your phone, the Google Assistant will be activated in the background and you can ask him questions without doing any squeeze gesture or something like that. So basically, Google Assistant is now much more efficient and much more active and you won't feel like you are actually talking with a machine. The Google Pixel 4 is gonna be available in three color options, black, white, and orange, and all of them has this black strip on the sides with different color power buttons, which is a nice touch. The Google Pixel 4 is expected to start at $799, and for Excel is expected to go at $999. So yeah, that's all about the Google Pixel 4. Let me know what you think about it, and like this video and subscribe to the channel to support this channel and yeah see you soon